Greetings, this is Brother Jackie at www.wildernessmountainministry.org. I'm uh, hitting on the Feast of Tabernacles of 2012 to, of a mighty visitation from our God. Uh, as it Feast of Tabernacles mean to dwell with one another, with God's people, to come together, to come out of the system, to come out of that world. It's time for God to save His people from their sins that they know they've been forgiven and to heal his people, to know they're healed and so their joy may return. So let's go into the last message, number five, of this Feast of Tabernacles, of this great, mighty pouring out of the Holy Ghost. Praise the Lord. Let's go into it. to the final call, whosoever will let him come and take the water of life freely. How does the world economy today fit into biblical prophecy? How do we understand the mysteries of the kingdom of God? What is happening in the world today in the news to tell us where we are in prophecy and what we should be preparing for? The Lamb has prevailed to open the book and to loose the seals. Okay, I'm going to be bringing you part three. <laughs> Oh, not part five, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm bringing you part five. And let's go for it. I think it was 55, something like that. So that's where we're going to start. So let's do it here. 55, 43. So let's pick up here. Here we go. Coming Bring in your reward with you to give to every man. Father, now touch each one here, Lord, beginning this Feast of Tabernacles, and let us feast. Amen. Let us feast with Him. Amen. Oh, yes. Because He saved us out of this generation. I believe that. Yes, amen. And has redeemed us worthy by the blood of the Lamb Amen. and the word of our testimony. We thank you for that, thank Lord. You, Lord. Thank you. We thank you for that. We thank you that we're able to suffer and count it a joy to suffer for his name's sake, your name's sake. Like I said, when, when we suffer and are reproached, you said, Happy are ye, the Spirit of glory rests upon you. Amen, Lord. Thank My you. Spirit. Thank you, Lord. We thank you for lifting up standards right yes, now. Yes. We thank you for breaking the yokes right thank now. You, thank you for that anointing you've Amen, seen. Lord God. Amen. Thank you. We thank you for that. Yes. Where you said you have no need that any man teach you. But the Spirit will lead you and guide you into all truth. We thank you for that, Lord. We're getting a glimpse here. Without a vision, the people perish, you people. But we thank you for the vision you've given to us in your church throughout the whole world. Pray for Keith now, Lord. Yes. Rita. Amen. Lord, I believe we're in the time. We, I need you. We need you. To move now on Keith, Lord, and Rita, and their friends, Lord, and others right now. As we look to you, Father, as you know, that well, and Jimmy and all of them, they, they, Lord, they're willing to come to, to put the roof on these houses for your people. They're willing to do it, but we need the finances. If we're going to go on and use this place, 
for your people we need the finances and I'm trusting you Lord I believe it's at the door so they can come on we don't have no time to waste and I pray now that your spirit be right there working with Keith and Rita yes. and even others, Lord, that we didn't even know about. Right now to perform it yes. and bring about the finances we need for division toward Israel yes. and feeding that remnant of your people and the dispersed when they're home during the coming famine and drought. Amen, Lord. Lord, we, we have the wheat, as you know, and we're willing to ready to ready start bagging it, yes, putting it in the containers. Yes, we're ready. Yes, so I'm asking you now, Father, in Jesus' name, put it on their heart. It's time, Lord, to see the millions come. Yes, you gave me a, a dream before I came up here. I ask you to visit me. Because I didn't know whether to sell the plants, get rid of it, as the man was wanting to purchase it. And I said, Lord, visit me Amen. over this. And then it was that man, Jim, Lord Winquist, that all of a sudden offered 1.3. That's what I heard. And now, Lord, let it not tarry anymore, but accomplish for unto the word is sent. It's been sowed out there. But let it come back this day as a witness. This day, Lord God, let that money come to help my all this up and get us moving forward. And it will. Oh, God. Oh, Lord. For the people to open it up to where I believe all the millions have come from to fill these places. Mm -hmm. People right out the storm, people that don't have time to prepare. Mm -hmm. I believe that. Father, I believe it. Mm -hmm. In Jesus' name. Lord, I thank you so much. I thank you so much. I believe you moved. Now it is time. Let us hear now from them. Let us hear. We went down there, Lord. We done all we could do. And now, it is time for you to move and to bring a witness back to confirm that all the things about the people coming here, you're going to send them, you're going to have a place for them to be safe, to ride out the storm, protect them in this wilderness place, to confirm that and even give a witness of us which way to go, what to do. Yeah. and distracting us mm. and we need that Lord now move upon their hearts Lord God yes. read us at this time as you have met with others Keith Lord mm -hmm. Kelly yes, and others Lord he knows he's been working with yes, and even others out there Lord has heard us in the past in the past, Lord, it's been crying, weeping. Some just fell away. Bring them back, restore them. Even some of those, <clears throat> Lord, that's heard the word that's been sown in the past. Move on them, Lord, to give for the vision of your people in Israel. And let it prosper, Lord, on the radio. When your word goes out, accomplish what, what it's Intended to do. Yes. Reach the right hearts of the right people. Yes. That, you, that you'll fill these places with. Mm -hmm. or, or become supporters. 
whatever day may be. This is our prayer. Mm -hmm. This is our need. Mm -hmm. And you said you shall supply all of our needs. Yes. Mm -hmm. We'll be riches in Christ Jesus. Father, let it no longer tarry now but accomplish. For until you send it, then come back as a swift witness. As we can and it done, we believe you. Mm -hmm. Father, it is time. The night season's coming when no man can work. It is time to get this door opened up. Amen. To get this place. And, and Lord, get it ready. Yeah. And totally self-sufficient. It's going to take funds, Father, as you know. You know what we have need of. And now, Lord, we look. For a mighty manifestation of your power in the midst of us and there, yes, Keith and all of them. To now manifest. In the name of Jesus. Yes, this day, Lord, let us behold your mighty hand of deliverance. And provide those funds and, and toward Israel to vision, Lord, and uh, to this place to begin to move forward. Yes, For the switch. And, and to get Keith and them here to open this door so others can come, Lord, to manage at this place. Amen. In Jesus' name. Father, we thank you. Yes. We thank you. Yes. Pray for your people. This is all for your people. Yes. This is all for your glory. Mm -hmm. Now let us see. The salvation, your salvation yes. out of all this. Yes. Jesus' name, let me hear from Keith. Yes. Let me hear from Ray the Lord. Let me hear from him. In Jesus' name. We confirm. Division of South Carolina to confirm it. Yes. Your word. What you said you would do. For a long time now to accomplish your bringing your people out of the system, out of this world, and out of the danger. To have a place. Speak to the widows, the Lord and widowers, and ever who, Lord, you know who they are. Let it grow. But it is time. In Jesus' name. Amen. This is Brother Jackie. Uh, that message was given on the Feast of Tabernacles, the beginning 2012, for a door opening and a mighty move of God of the outpouring of His Spirit upon us. A reminder of what's coming when He stays on the day of Pentecost for the church. So I uh, hope you liked the message. Uh, it was here's some of my first preaching. I preached like this for about 20, 30 years. So to my family, friends, and whoever I could reach out to. So. Brother Jackie at uh, www.wildernessmountainministry.org. Write us and let us know what you think about this. And get out of there. In Jesus' name, we're closing. God bless and thank you.